this is Jay. In this video, we are going to discuss about a bullet chart. So, the persons who have no idea about what is a bullet chart, this is the bullet graph, simple as a bullet chart. And bullet chart demands zero or two measures, zero or measures, dimensions, and two measures basically. And two measures is actually a mandate because like we have to point some point of time, some point of places. Like, let's see that how we can do it. Let me choose profit and then let me choose. A discount, I think discount should work, I guess. Okay, fine, then yeah, let's take that and then I choose it here. Look at it here the profit and then the bulleting is not making much of a sense, and then coming maybe like yeah, the inferencing is not making much sense. I will take quantity and then the profit to understand that. Cool, then yeah, this is making much sense. And finally, let me take category level into rows. I think might maybe like it. Category is also not making much sense, then I would choose subcategory so that we can have a better inference cool so we are getting look at it here the bullet point is basically the average quantity is 1 2 4 1 which has been happening for tables here it is actually 518 similarly for each and every segments every subcategories we are getting a bullet where on top of it something is performed beyond that it's kind of like whether to adjust or not it's kind of a reference line for each and every segment that we are selecting for if this is beyond this or less than this we can make some business inferences okay so whichever segments has been like having more than of the bullet point that we have it's making much sense because that might be making a better profit comparing with the other one simple as that so like the lower value of the bullet line and then the line which has been keep proceeding after that making a better inference I guess this can be a small scenario where we can start with and finally if you wanted to add something on top of it let me add a category to the colors yeah. getting a better insight I guess look at it which one is actually making everywhere its profit or not in that way seems like the blue in color which is basically furniture some places it's making a loss Look at it here, it's making a loss comparing with the bullet lines, it's showing that upfront, but ideally the other one, like technology is nowhere making a loss. Okay. And then like some point of time, even office supplies having a value which is less than that, so like overall scenario, it seems like technology making a better inference rather than the other two categories. This insight has been getting captured with the help of bullet chart, not specifying any of the ranges or something and directly getting the values just by making a bullet chart. This is what an advantage of using a bullet chart. This is what it is actually. Cool then yeah, thanks for watching this video. See you in the next video.